was uh, just doing some thinking, as I often do, because as you know, I'm a bit of a philosopher when it comes to things like this. No, I'm just messing with you. But anyway, um... To... I, don't know, I guess to say to the people who really, really just hate Nintendo, I mean absolutely hate Nintendo, not talking about the, uh, the people who troll or have a have a, a just a normal dislike. I'm talking about the people who straight out just hate its fucking existence. You know, not the people who are like, eh, it's just not my thing, uh, it's not really something I'm into, I don't like the company or the system that I want. You know, those people are fine. You know, I got no problem with them because they have rational points that they make, so you really can't be mad at them for things like that. Although some people just get mad at them, I think those people are crazy too because they're like, oh, why you don't you like them? It's like, not everybody's gonna like them. But, so the people who straight out want them to go away, want them to, like, not exist anymore or make games because they, they feel that, uh, the kind of games they make have no place in the industry of today or some shit like that. I mean, I don't know why they would think that, but a lot of you people, I can't help but notice that you, in fact, give more attention to the company than a lot of the people who actually like them. I, I mean, seriously, you guys are just so busy talking shit about them and trying to prove a point that they just don't need to be around when you go away that you're too busy, like, paying attention to that and not your own, you know, system of choice. So, uh... It's like a lot of you will just go and you'll look for anything, anything about Nintendo, mostly the negative stuff. You'll go to Nintendo's fans' websites and stuff like that. You go to their YouTube channel, you go to Nintendo pages or whatever, and you will sit there and just talk all kinds of crap for whatever reason to see and just make yourselves, I don't know, feel better about your gaming system of choice or whatever. I mean, I don't really understand a lot of the logic behind that, but a lot of people are like that. And, uh, a recent example I can think of is, uh, the recent, uh, from statistics I found out about is, like, on some certain Twitch pages. Alright, Nintendo's Twitch stream or whatever for whatever their E3 stuff was had about 40,000... ...40,000, 40, um, plus, you know, watchers, viewers, stuff like that. Sony, meantime, had about 2,000. So, uh, that, that's something to think about right there. Now, I can almost guarantee that a lot of the people that were in that stream watching it, a lot of, maybe not a huge chunk, but a decent amount of that 40k, 40,000 people, were actual, like, Sony fans, and I'm looking at you, Sony fans, you seem to be the biggest culprits about this. I'm sure there's some Xbox, people, Xbox fans out there who were doing the doing the same thing, acting the same way, so, you know, but for the most part, I guarantee you a lot of them were sitting there, watching that stream, just talking shit, and finding material that they need for their videos so they can say things like, ah, oh, that was crap, oh, that was crap. I mean, they're basically sitting there making themselves miserable by looking at what they can to see what they think is, is sucks, is not good, and they're like, oh, oh, no, that's terrible, oh, that's stupid. Uh, you, you guys could have been at your, uh, at your Sony video, you know, praising them, you know, saying, oh, thank you, Sony, thank you for doing what you're doing. Oh, we love you so much, Sony. Oh, if you were a chick or a dude, I'd have sex with you, Sony. You know, whatever, stuff like that. You know, the way they just eat that shit up. But, you know, instead of doing that, you're sitting there over at the Nintendo page going, psh, psh, psh. Nah, Sony stuff is better. Xbox stuff is better. Psh, no. Ah, uh -uh, no, nah, this sucks. Oh, this is just casual. This is all casual. No, I think casual. Oh, wait, no, I don't think I put that up there where I said that. So, uh, ignore what I said right there. But anyway, yeah, it's basically, you know, they're sitting there just going and they're talking more shit. I mean, you guys pay more attention than Nintendo does than your own favorite company. I mean, you'll go to Nintendo pages, websites, you'll go to fans, you'll talk shit to them, you know, oh, well, Nintendo sucks, blah, 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 blah. Power, 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 graphic, graphic resolution, and stuff like that. And you're, like, nowhere near supporting your own shit. Because you're too busy, like, paying most attention to what they're doing. 
And it's like, seriously, guys, this this is you. Do you not like see yourselves in the mirror and think, well, shit, maybe I uh, I'm a little too obsessed with this, you know? Because a lot of people just fucking are, and a lot of people who just like really pissed off for Nintendo for whatever reason are too busy just paying attention to them. It's like it's like you're being a stalker chick. You know, you, you claim to be over some dude, he'll be better than what you are just, just watching every fucking thing he does. Oh, wow. Look, oh, oh, who, who's he talking to? On the third, who's that he's talking to? Oh, you're just stalking him and you're just, like, watching It's all shit like that. Do, do you not see what I'm saying here? You probably don't, but... Anyway, that's the point I'm trying to make, that a lot of them are just, like, you know, a lot of you are just too busy paying attention to what you hate to talk shit about it instead of what you love to talk great about it. So I just wanted to throw that out there. A couple of things I want to get off my chest there, but you know, just stuff I want to talk about. And uh, that's just my philosophy on that, that if you hate them so much, why do you bother paying so much damn attention to them?